Hey, what's everybody? It's time for another comic book review. Today's review is brought to you by the Clever Presents. He has three. He wanted me to do three, so I'm gonna do those three first, and then do whatever ones I want after. If you want to go subscribe to him, he does. He does videos as well. He does pretty good videos. Yeah, I think he's more more well spoken than I am, and he's prettier. I think. <laughs> anyway, yes, his link will be over here somewhere, or over here, or in the description. Go subscribe to him because he's cool. So. First thing I want me to review is Red Lanterns number 27. I really enjoyed this book. Before I get into a spoiler, it was good. It was good. It was good. It was good. So we start off with the right where the other one left off, where the Reds on the planet that where the dictator was, and they built them a rush. Um, they built the Reds a rush more basically. You can see that. Built, built them a m Mount Rushmore to them and guy has a beard and mustache pretty cool looks make him look a boss and we continue on basically they're gonna leave and they say if you become monsters we'll be back and we'll do what we did to the other guy to you so we'll be watching so when they leave before they leave bleeds asks guy about the ring they talk about uh, ranchets rackets uh, ring and how when a, a new ring bearer is p picked for a red, they go crazy and kill a bunch of people. So guy says that you and you can go and find this thing, and Rencor follows, and they go find this ring. Well, guy wants to go back to Earth and talk to someone, so Zox and Skrullox go with him to Earth, and they split up. Zox and Skrullox go to Earth. And Rancor and Bleeds go look for the ring. So, when Zox and the Skrillox and Guy get to the Earth, they basically split up. Zox and Skrillox go sightseeing, and Guy goes sees a member of Just League International, I believe. That's who they they were on a, a team together, and I guess they were had a thing going on. Uh, she's fire. He's fire. She's ice. Get it? Fire, ice, hot, and cold, icy, hot. So I guess she didn't like that he was always so angry. He's showing her that he can control his anger. He's a red lantern. I guess he still wants to be with her. And Zox and Skrullox are seeing sights like they go see the the Grand Canyon and stuff. It's really funny. They have good witty dialogue between the two. And then Guy had also said, don't fight anyone because there's a lot of superpower people and not all of them are bad. Don't go on fighting unless they hit you first. And who do they find? The one person on Earth that would shoot first and ask questions later? Shadow Thief. If you don't know who Shadow Thief is, she is a alien hater even though she wears an alien suit. And Skrellox pointed that out to him. To her, he says, yeah, you're wearing an alien. Probably you smell like alien. She freaks out and attacks them. And uh, they shoot the light at her. She absorbs it. It's like, aha, your light thing don't work on me. And then Zox barfs, basically barfs on her. Like you can see right here. Basically pukes on her. It was awesome. Got gr grossed me out a little bit, but I thought it was pretty funny. So they start, they start to fight. Zox uh, and Skrillox, well, Skrillox calls Guy and they need help. And we quickly flick back over to uh, Rancor and Bleeds, who have found the uh, the newest ring bearer. But not only have they found the newest ring bearer, they found three ring bearers. And that would be this new fish one, who I can only seem, assume has the, other, the new ring. And Atrocitus and his kitty cat. And he says, in my in my best Atrocitus voice, Bleeds, Rancor, do please come in. And then the kitty's like, Whoosh. and yeah, I actually really, I really enjoyed this. It was really, it was thoroughly enjoyable. I liked it a lot. And uh, I would give it a 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10. It wasn't anything epic. It was pretty funny. 
So I give it a seven. And yeah, if you if you read this, tell me what you thought about it in the comment section down below. Don't forget to go subscribe to Clever Presents and subscribe to me because I'm cool. Like and subscribe. And if you haven't already checked out my pull list video, it will be over here. And below it, I'm going to put my newest show I have on my channel called What's Getting Canned. And you can go check that out and tell me what you think of What's Getting Cancelled. And that's about it. I am the Combo Addict, and I am signing off.